Hi, my name is Jessica Brozig. I am IC Safety Sensor Specialist for the Wausau Point area for Warner Electric. Um, today I am going to show you how to configure a safety relay. It's our GSR DIS, so DI for dual input, S for uh, solid state output. Um, we have a couple of different flavors of the GSR, but today we're going to be going over this. So it's real basic, there's not a whole lot to it. There is a dial on the front which sets your configuration and you'll notice there's one through eight. So it's going to be dependent on whether or not you have one or two devices in inputting and then whether you want them to be ANDed or ORed. Um, so that is listed in the uh, user manual. So we'll go ahead and get started right away. I'm going to start by taking the power off of here. So we're just going to pop this off. Okay. So to start the configuration process or the override process, with the power off, we're going to turn the rotary dial on the front to zero. So I'm going to go ahead and get that at zero. And then we're going to power it up to test and the power LED will flash red. So to set the configuration or the choice that we're going to have, we're going to turn the dial to whatever we want. I'm going to go ahead and put it on section one, which is manual monitored reset, and it's going to be input one or input two or L12, which is your single wire safety. So go ahead and put that at one. And then the green flashing tells you what it's at. So we're going to lock in the configuration by cycling power. So again, I'm just going to pop that off. Power off. Give it a few seconds. And then we're going to put it back on. So once the configuration is set, then you just want to confirm that that is actually what you want and then you can um, write the configuration in a spot there so if somebody turns the dial, you actually know what the original configuration was set for. If you'd like more information on the GSR family, go ahead and contact your account manager with Warner Electric or your product specialist.